Uh, what award, Subhashini, you, you win this one? It was a trailblazer and innovator. Yes. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh-huh. yes. Uh-huh. Okay, Subhashini, a uh, young girl often hesitate to enter on uh, your industry. Mm. And what do you think we can do to change that? Yes, yes. I think there's a... Um, there's a preconceived idea that only smart and intelligent people can do science. Mm-hmm. And because it's that idea, it's almost like an individual walk. Mm-hmm. I believe, I come from a teaching background, mm-hmm. so I'm going to talk in terms of that perspective. Please. If we have collaborative mm-hmm. projects where many more people are stepping into science together, someone's limitation is other person's uh, strength and vice versa this community of practice in science becomes stronger for a young girl that's one thing so having group groups rather than individuals the individual is a very yesterday's story together we walk far right and the other thing is pairing up young females with mentors with people who have walked the walk, talked the talk, um, but having someone as a mentor. I've got great mentors in my life who have been my supervisors, who have been my teachers from 30 years back. They're still my mentors. And so I think every person having one or two mentors, young females going trying to go into STEM, will really benefit from that. Because they don't wait 